a war unlike any other. A conflict of ideas and aspirations, the American War of Independence began here on the Lexington Green, with the shot heard around the world. The American revolutionaries fought to create a new nation that would uphold the ideals of liberty, equality, and responsible citizenship. Massachusetts was first in the fight to secure these ideals. Our home is the birthplace of freedom for our nation. Founding Father Thomas Jefferson once said, the price of freedom is eternal vigilance. Massachusetts Republican Governor Charlie Baker has now signed into law a measure establishing abortion and gender-affirming care as constitutional rights. A move pro-life activists contend will turn the state into an abortion sanctuary. The social conservative advocacy group Massachusetts Family Institute says the legal protections for abortionists extend to organizations who distribute puberty blockers and cross-sex hormones, even in states where they've been criminalized for use on children. For 31 years, Massachusetts Family Institute has been vigilant to guard and defend against the attacks on our faith, families, and freedoms. Well, about five years ago, we, we started to see the identity crisis that we don't just have in Massachusetts, but all over the United States. So we knew we had to do something. So the first thing that came to mind was the school. And uh, we started uh, working around putting the school together. And that's when we reached uh, to MFI uh, about, uh, you know, how to, how to approach the city. And um, we really got good uh, coaching from the beginning. We had to go to the city, fill out an application. Uh, they delayed that application for a whole year. They were not okay with the Christian school abstaining kids from uh, knowing about their agenda. Through MFI and all of their support, I was able to run for school committee here in Worcester. Because of it, we had a fantastic um, campaign that really catapulted the sex ed to the forefront. MFI supported in so many ways. Since the overturning of Roe v. Wade, uh, pregnancy centers in Massachusetts have been facing tremendous backlash and opposition. And as soon as we were personally attacked, first person I called was Andrew Beckwith at MFI and he was so helpful and so instrumental in advising us and giving me insight and input on how to draft a letter to helping us form a coalition of pregnancy centers to go forward and to be stronger in fighting some of these uh, battles. When faith-based institutions are treated unlawfully, MFI is first in the fight to protect their religious freedom and ensure they can pursue their mission and ministry free of government interference. Massachusetts Family Institute will remain steadfast in the fight, dedicated to defending the ideals upon which our Commonwealth and our nation were founded. Even in the Bay State, where this fight is often the hardest, victories can be won. For the past 31 years, Massachusetts Family Institute has been the leading pro-family organization in the Commonwealth protecting and strengthening Massachusetts families. We are grateful for your support. Without it, it would not be possible to continue our legacy in defending faith, family, and freedom in the Commonwealth.